Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Laurel Park here on this Monday program here on Monday. It is January the 4th, 2016. They are running on Mondays at Laurel Park from now until about the middle of February, which is a great idea uh, since uh, Philadelphia Parks Racing is, uh, isn't is running. So um, I think they're going to have some really... Um, Good money. Good money is going to be made at Laurel for the people there. Um, before I get on to the race, race eight, which I'm going to handicap. Uh, remember to follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid Five for more selections. The eighth race from Laurel Park is Lamps Optional Claimer Purse, forty-two thousand dollars for three holes and upwards. Number one race on main claim starter, waiver claiming, or state sired stakes, or state bred race, or which number one two race claim price fifty to forty-five thousand dollars. Nine winners one. We do have a field of nine horses traveling one mile to the second finish line one mile and I'm gonna go with the um, four horse here who's gonna be my top selection um, number four Mo for the money I'm gonna key him on top for a 50 cent try it's gonna cost you a dollar this bet and underneath I'm gonna box to one three so it's four keyed in with the one three boxed on the bottom gonna cost you dollar uh number four mo for the money h5 alex and tron for tony dutra out of uncle mo the streels uh purchased at keelan in september 2014 for two hundred twenty five thousand dollars but our last time out the run at aqueduct six rungs november the 27th and the king swan stakes for hundred uh, forty seven you know uh finished third by twelve and a half lengths that day he was just uh out of it um after the half, you know, he just was starting to weaken. We lost by three and a half lengths in a field of five horses that day. Um, then at Belmont on the mud, six frongs on October 28th and Main Freshway for 75,000. One by head that day. Um, it was four wide the quarter pole. was really drifting, but uh, really was was leading there. But he was really good. I have to say it was a really nice victory for this horse. Um, going a mile for the first time today. Hopefully this course, uh, this horse could really handle the course. Um, so I'm going to go with this one. Has a workout. Fair Hills uh, training uh, track. Seven furlongs, seven furlongs of the all-weather surface and 127 flat. The best out of two that day. And a six furlong workout on the dirt of Fair Hills and 115 and one. The best out of two workouts that day. I'm going to go with this one, 8-5, to five, Alex and Tron. So we count my bets for race number 8 from Lower Park. I'm going to go with the 4 horse, who's my top selection uh, for a try. I'm going to key him on top. On, underneath, I'm going to box to 1-3. Good luck to all, and follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5 Good luck, everybody.